Hey everyone, welcome back to another vlog. It's been a long time since we caught up. I've not been great at doing YouTube and my YouTube videos. Anyways, I'm getting back into it. There was just like a lot going on with moving offices, which you're gonna see later in this video. Um, but I wanted to give you kind of like another update. I feel like every time I chat with you, I'm giving you updates, but life is just crazy at the moment. Moving offices really took so much time and energy. Um, CNC has been crazy busy, which I'm so grateful for. There's a lot of new stuff coming there. e move, which I'll get into in just a little, and there's just like a lot going on. But now I'm getting really back and forth. Also, I post almost every day on Instagram, so if you um, don't follow me on there, you really should. <laughs> Shameless plug. Recently, a little life update. It's actually not my life. Um, but I feel like I haven't chatted with you in a really long time, but Etan, my boyfriend, moved into a new apartment. So he moved out back in February. So he moved out back in February and he loved it. And so he then found a new place when that little situation was over. He found a new place um, and it's a really cute apartment downtown. One of the things I get asked about all the time is does Etan live with me? And I think that's because in so many of my past relationships, like you guys have seen me through so many relationships that I've been in and they've all lived with me. <laughs> Not, okay, that never happened because I was like, hey, you know what's a really fun idea after two weeks of dating? Why don't you move in? No, it, it just kind of like, they just like invaded, they invaded. It, it was never like a, a sit down conversation, like here's a key to the house, like let's move in. It was kind of like they would bring something over and then they would never leave. So I've lived with boyfriends in the past and you know what, I am not going to be doing wifey things on a girlfriend's salary. There is just so many things I learned from the past relationship and that's why I say never regret a past relationship because even though those were very traumatic for me and I'm still working through a lot of trauma from those relationships, um, I've learned so much and I wouldn't give up those relationships because they made me who I am today, how I am in a relationship today. They taught me what I want from a boyfriend and a partner today and literally e is all of those things and so i have a tendency i had a tendency to really rush into things and really you know say that is absolute like we've been together for two weeks why why wouldn't you move in to my house where i pay all the rent um anyways so going into this relationship i really proceeded with caution not because I felt like I needed to with him, but I really wanted to set up boundaries for myself because I do have a tendency for falling for someone and then giving basically like my whole life to them. And I really wanted to keep doing all the things that I was doing while I was single because I really liked who I was becoming and, and what I was finding out about myself. And so with E10, he is not the type of person to just like move on into my space and he likes his alone time. He has his own life. He has his own friends. He does his own thing. And so do I and that is how I really like it and honestly I really like him having a place downtown and I like living in like the suburbs outside of the city because then if I go downtown on the weekend I can just like sleep over there it's not like a whole drive home and honestly as I've gotten older my opinion on moving in together has completely changed I used to be someone where I was like before we even get engaged I absolutely need to live with that person and it's still a reasonable thing I understand why that's really important to someone, but for me now, it's almost like unless I am married, I'm not going to change aspects of my life, you know? Like, I'm not going to buy a house with someone I'm not married to because that is just as much as a legally binding contract as a marriage certificate, you know? Like, there's just no way I would do that. So all that to say, no, <laughs> we don't live together. We're not going to be living together anytime soon. And yeah, we're just like we both just really like how things are at the moment. He has his place in the city, and it's really it works out really well. He comes over once or twice a week, sleeps over like after work or on Sunday, and then if we go out for dinner, we'll go back to his place in the city, or we'll just like stay there on weekends. It's working really well, and why would I want to disturb something that's working really well? Even with the idea of marriage and kids, like we, I've been getting asked that so much recently. I did a Q&A on Instagram and those were like all the questions, even in my personal life, like people are getting married left, right and center. And I guess because of that, a lot of like my friends and family ask me and it's like, 
what's the rush and that's just my opinion for my life like i see people getting engaged and i'm so happy for them and that's right for them in their life but at the moment there's so much i want to do before i get married there's so much i want to do before i get I have kids and so much i want to see so so many places i want to travel that for me in my life it's just not something that i'm going to be doing within the next few years i just think that i'm really happy with my life right now and how things are going and my relationship that like i don't know i'm just like enjoying it i'm not like thinking about like what's next what's next i just want to enjoy how things are at the moment um but with all that to say etan did just move into a really cute apartment and when he was moving um i was like trying to give him everything oh you need a bed like please take my spare bed oh you need a couch does my couch fit like i was trying to give him everything he wouldn't accept anything from me um except i did um give him my brooklyn in sheets that no longer fit my beds he has a queen size bed um, and so i have a lot of brooklyn and sheets that don't fit my bed my bed is so comfortable he loves brooklyn and so much that he that's the only thing he would accept from me was my Brooklyn and sheets. But anyways, I got some new sheets and we're gonna unbox them. That's why my bed's not made. Brooklyn, and I'm not kidding you, is the best, softest, most luxurious bedding. They have towels. They even have like, I, one sec. They even have this. They even have like products. This is their fabric spray. I, I spray this on my bed every single day because it makes it smell so amazing. Um, but they are the best, most luxurious soft bedding you will ever put on your bed you will feel like you are in a five-star luxury hotel every single night my goal with my house was to make it feel like a luxury hotel on a budget and brooklinen is the perfect way to do that because they cut out the middleman um so you get really luxurious high quality bedding for such an amazing price it's not even funny why are you going to reserve that for like luxury experiences when you can experience that every day and you don't have to break the bank to do that and that's why i love brooklyn and because they offer such high quality bedding sheets everything for such an amazing price. And right now I do have a coupon code on orders over $100. You can save $20 with the code Tony Dallas. I'll put it right here and in the description box along with links to Brooklinen. They are such high quality, last forever. I'm not kidding, the first sheet set I ever bought from Brooklinen still feels just as soft. Honestly, it feels softer the more times you wash it. Um, and whenever you're shopping on Brooklinen, make sure you buy, we don't have to, but I would really recommend buying the hardcore sheet bundle because just by buying the bundle, you save 25%. And then if you spend over $100, which you will, because the bundle is over $100, you can save an additional 20% dollars in the organic sheet set you get the core sheet set which has the a flat sheet a fitted sheet and two pillowcases you get the duvet cover and then you get two additional pillowcases i'm really excited about their new organic sheet set because they are certified organic so they are grown organically and then they also meet the environmental and socially responsible standards these have a 300 thread count they are soft and breathable and perfect for most sleepers especially in the summertime so i'm going to take these out while them put them on my bed and i'll show you guys what it looks like all right so they are on my bed they are so incredibly soft and comfy what's great is that with the bundle you can actually get different colors you don't have to get all white or all one color you can get your second pillows in a different color your duvet cover in a different color you can get everything in a different color i just went for all the classic white but you can really customize it to whatever you need so i will leave them linked in the description make sure to check them out and thank you brooklinen for sponsoring this video as you guys know i got in a car accident back in april when someone blew a red light i crashed into him and my car has been getting fixed ever since then which has been a pain in my ass because every part seemed to be back ordered according to the garage and finally i had enough and i called literally the bmw dealership and they were like yeah we have that part so i've been waiting for weeks and weeks and weeks for a back order part that i found in one phone call it was my best friend's birthday um on saturday it's monday today she wanted to go away for a little girls trip and so we went to toronto i love toronto and I'm, i love it even more now that i'm like i go so often oh by the way this is our solitaire emerald luxe ring like a 3.5 carat so it's smaller than um our la last luxe ring look how freaking stunning that is and then this is i always get asked about my jewelry so i thought i would just show you this is the most beautiful evil eye necklace we have a few left 
Celine necklace. These are the rain earrings. Brown silk scrunchie. Actually, look how cute this little jewelry case is. This was a sample. I, I love it. The quality is amazing. It's just a little bit big, so I'm going to make it a little bit smaller. Um, and I want to maybe add a mirror. Let me know what you think. This is just a sample. But um, I, we also have, they're coming, the earrings, the rain earrings in green. I don't know which I want. Anyways, we also have um, new, we're getting new heart earrings. They're like a little bit of a brighter gold. This is the treasure, chunky treasure bracelet. It's so pretty. We're getting our production wash samples today. I cannot wait to remember that. I cannot wait to show you that. Um, this is the size comparison between the, well, these are sold out. Oops. But these are the 4.7 carat oval, 3.5 carat emerald. But while I was there, we went to Holtz and they were having the best shoe sale on the planet. I got a pair of shoes. It was just crazy. I honestly couldn't believe it. And they had such good shoes in the sale as well. So I was so honored because I bought my best friend her first pair of designer heels. And I have just like thought I was perfect that I was the one to do that with her um, because I love designer heels. And then I also wanted to get a pair of heels to remember the trip by. I wouldn't have just bought a pair of heels if they weren't super cute, but it was like meant to be. So I saw these and they were absolutely perfect in my size and they were half price. And my favorite style of heel. They're like a brown faux croc. The Kate is the 100 millimeter heel. The So Kate is the 120 millimeter heel, heel. But these are just so much more comfortable than the higher heel, obviously. They were literally half off. More than half, more than half off. So I had to pick them up. I was like, it's just meant to be because I wear these shoes all the time. They're my most worn heels. And I have a pair of brown, but they're like a, a lighter brown. And then these are the perfect darker brown. You can't really see the croc on it, which is what I really liked. But they are like the perfect, can you see? The perfect brown heel. I texted them to Nikki and she always tells me like, Oh, these are my Tommy John PJs. I absolutely love them. She always tells me, like, no, you don't need them, or, like, absolutely yes. And she was like, you absolutely need them. She was also trying to convince me to buy this brown Chanel bag, and I was like, you were literally just telling me that I need to stop shopping. You are the problem. Why do I look so freaking red? I swear I don't look this crazy. My face is so swollen because I ate such good food, um, but I could feel it, like, in my lips, especially once I my mom's calling. Hello? Hi, hey, Mom. Sorry, my mom called as I was vlogging. And when Mom calls, we always answer. Thankfully, I'm leaving because my power literally just went out. It could not be a nicer day out. I do not understand. I'm going to buy a generator because this is crazy. I got a package in from NARS, which I'm super excited about. First of all, this makeup bag, so cute. Definitely going to bring this with me on my trip. But they sent me a restock which is good because i was actually getting low of my favorite foundation the light reflecting foundation and then also the new light reflecting eye eye brightener i got the shade night swan i love their potted concealer but this feels like a lot creamier oh i wish i could have tried that today Ooh, it feels so creamy I wonder if I can put that on. My eyes are already bright though, and I have powder, but whatever. Did that do anything? I can't see. Ooh. I already actually had an eyebrow. Ooh. Ooh. Whoa. Whoa. You guys. Did you see that? And then they also sent me this, which is, I don't know if this is new, but it's the light reflecting setting powder. This isn't translucent. This is a really good packaging because look how big that mirror is and it comes with this little sponge so I mean, i'm looking a little shiny let's see how this works did that do anything Ooh, i really like that under eye thing that i just put on i might have to go and see the other colors anyways I gotta go. I don't mean like playing around here. I am in line at Starbucks. I have to get a little pick me up for my drive because it's about half an hour away where my car is. Don't ask me why I went there. 
Could have picked any garage, picked one half an hour away. Um, but I wanted to get Starbucks and they also have these new egg bites and I'm a huge fan of the egg bites. So I wanted to test them out and the guy working here is so sweet. Okay, I picked up my car. It looks brand new. I'm so freaking, like, although it's not as conducive to vlogging. I'm so excited. It looks so happy. It feels like I got, I got a new car. I am running into the mall now because I want to see if they have those MAC lipsticks that everyone seems to have no brain cells when they're using recently. The one, that is one thing that really pisses me off. Like when someone uses something in like such a stupid way that's obviously not how you're meant to be using it and then acts like it's the product's problem. It's like you're the problem. It's not a product. So they didn't have any color that I wanted. I wanted like one of the brown ones or, I don't know, really just one of those. And they were out of stock. But they had like blue and green and while that's cool, I just know I'm not gonna like use that all the time. And everyone on Instagram and TikTok like puts it up like a lipstick when it's a lip gloss like in a tube I'm not sure of the confusion because makeup by mario literally has the same lipstick component lip gloss component this is my favorite lip liner for like my literally my lips but better it's from gucci though so i'm savoring it because i will not repurchase it okay Ooh. Ooh. it smells really good very glossy. Ooh, a little bit minty. I don't need lip plumper, <laughs> but mmm. Okay, I'm happy I actually did pick this up. Blended with my finger. I love um, lip glosses in a stick. Hello. <laughs> so this is the updated office area. I'm debating where I want to put clothes. I think I might want to put like hangers like on the wall, you know? You want to put clothes in here? I don't know. Like the, the clothes, like not like... Oh, not like your closet. No, like, okay, like, yeah. like clothes. This wall is getting curtains on it. Um, we have to decide on that. But so far, this area... Looks really cute. Those stools, we have to I want to get like a little console table or something for underneath. But Allie found these at Tiger Giant or Giant Tiger. Each were how much? $109. $109. They're, so we got two of them. And if we keep them on this wall, this is what they look like. Debbie Travis. And they also come like with black, right? Yeah. Keep them on this wall, we'll probably get a third. And we have a third in my car. Oh, you went and got it? I went and got one. Um, and so they're really nice and, and narrow because this is like the pathway so we didn't want to keep it like too blocked but that'll be good to keep like inventory in it I don't know I think it's kind of cute there I think the ones with the black wood would have been cute there I just don't know because of the I mean I mean it's not that different it's not a completely different tone no. and like on and this part matches it mm -hmm. can we turn off the fluorescence sure <laughs> she's just being nice with the cameras <laughs> normally she like Ooh. that looks nice yeah. don't it it does don't it it, it do it do <laughs> okay i came home to the most exciting package should not take the longest because they're all handmade watches so they take forever to be made these have been in production for a few months so when they first make them we get renderings of them because we know the quality of the watches we don't get like complete samples before production starts and then um post-production they send us a production sample because one time before we knew because we're always learning new things before we knew um to ask for a production sample um because our watches we order like thousands of watches right so we were shipped our thousands of watches and there was an issue with every watch and that was like a huge loss for cnc and it wasn't it was like also disappointing because so many of you were waiting to be able to buy these watches and i the, the issue with the watch was very minute that everyone i've showed was like you should just sell them and i was like they're not perfect i'm not selling them so we had to scrap a lot of those watches 
um, have them, parts of them completely remade. Anyways, so now we're extra vigilant and we got these samples and I am so freaking excited to see these because we got new colors that you guys are going to die over. I'm literally getting teary eyed. 31 millimeters brown. Okay, you guys. Brown sun dial. Are you kidding? Are you kidding? That has to be. That has to be a joke. We also have 28 millimeters. So the most we have, we have 36 millimeter washers. They're just not as popular, so we didn't order them again. Um, but we do have some. But on the 28 millimeter, we did notches instead of diamonds. All right. So the next day, I was so excited. Yesterday, I completely forgot to check back in. Um, and then I went to my sister's house to show her the watches and have dinner. So, um, yeah, it's the next day. But I did want to show you guys a little sneak peek of some of the watches. I'm literally editing the vlog that you are watching right now. Um, this was the last, our last collection, the green one. Let me know if you want me to bring it back. We have the 28 millimeter brown. We are bringing back the president. We also have a two-tone president. This is my new favorite. It is a silver sundial. Two-tone with a gold dial will be back. Two-tone with a black dial will be back. And we also have a small two-tone and gold as well. But I've packed that. All right, guys, so I forgot to finish out this vlog. I have since been to the Hamptons. We're at the office now with Sweet. Oh, don't mind the mess. We are um, getting clothes. Well, Nikki is really getting clothes ready for to sell them here which will be very soon also we are going to be getting pickup available very soon so if you order jewelry you can come pick it up which is very exciting oh i should probably show you oh you saw already you saw the office anyways nothing nothing new no, there is new stuff but they saw in this vlog but even with the cute little new like candles oh okay and the clothes there is some new stuff so the office is a little bit of a mess we're still um getting things organized with the clothes so that's where i'm all selling um, there more and then here you guys saw I decided to keep these um, things little things between the shelves I think it looks really good so this is some clothes um, that we're going to be selling at the boutique this isn't like my clothes but it's just you know some clothes and then we have some candles we're not just gonna be selling our stuff I have to finish doing that but we, if you have any brands you want us to carry, leave them in the comments because we have that so far. We have our favorite perfume oils. So yeah, there's a lot going on here. Um, and we just got back from Nikki's birthday trip to the Hamptons, which was really, really fun. Did you have a good time? I had a great time, very relaxing. But we are back to work now. So I hope you guys enjoyed this vlog. Let me know if you like these vlogs more where it's like one day in the life. Um, versus you know a bunch of days in the life Nikki, my brain is not braining today okay um i'm definitely gonna be vlogging more on thursday something exciting is i'm going to get my lip filler dissolved um which you're probably like tony i literally just in in the last video you posted you got lip filler and um that's true but sometimes i have difficulty speaking due to my lip filler so I'm also just over it and I feel like it migrated a little so I don't know I'm gonna take you to that and that's gonna be really fun and exciting so uh, don't forget to check out Brooklinen by the way update I've been sleeping on those organic sheets sheets for a while now and I think they're my new favorite for the summer they're a lot cooler a lot more breathable I just have been having the best sleeps ever so make sure to use my code um, Tony of Dallas to get $20 off your order when you're staring at me when I'm filming. I just want to make sure you're saying the right thing. Oh. She's like literally mm. eyeing me like it, with her eyes and I'm trying to have a I conversation with you. I just want to make sure you. you're saying the right code. Oh, okay. To the code is Tony of Dallas for $20 off orders over $100. Slay. So we're going to get back to work. I have to finish editing this vlog, make a thumbnail and all that fun stuff. And I'll see you guys back here next time. Bye. Bye.